because people think Stephen Hawking surely right. didn't get his math wrong. But he did, actually. So what he calculated back in 1974 is that a black hole, so you, you, we picture this distortion in space and time. They glow, so they have a temperature. They emit radiation, it's called Hawking radiation, which means that they shrink because they're, they're emitting stuff. So that means they have a lifetime. One day they'll be gone. But you have to address this question of what happened to all the stuff that fell in. And his calculation said that there's no record at all of anything that fell in, in all this radiation that's come off the black hole. So it's really true that if I got this notepad and pen, right, and I, I wrote some things on it, and then I set fire to this, in principle, according to all the laws of nature that we know, if you collected everything that came off, all the radiation, all the bits of ashes and things, and you could just measure it all, the idea is you could reconstruct the information. But this calculation that Stephen did said there is no information in that radiation at all. So it seemed that uniquely black holes erase information.